Today we are back as a repo man. We've got two luxury Bugattis on the list, but we need a special tow truck. So let's head to the shop. The tow truck that we need is the Peterbilt 567 flatbed. The reason is, is this one's got really good rollback capabilities and it's also got a winch. So we're able to winch these vehicles up on the trailer. We are taking these Bugattis back because the people that finance them, they're not able to make the payments. So we got to go grab them and return them to the bank. The bank is located in the town. And that's going to be our drop-off point. So we're going to customize the cool tow truck out. And it's going to be paid for by the bank. So it's going to be pretty cool. Let's see. We can do a couple different options back here. I think we'll just leave the wood. It's cheaper. And then we can color match this thing. I like the all blacked out theme. That looks pretty sweet. Let's go ahead and buy it. $100,000. Not my money. All right, boys. We got ourselves a tow truck here. This thing is pretty sweet. I didn't know it came with all these light beacons on it. They're all over the place around the entire rollback, the front grill and everything. Check that out. This is awesome. It's a comfortable tow truck and it should get the job done without damaging these Bugattis. But the only problem is guys is these Bugattis are locked behind a garage door. So we're going to have to find a way to break it and enter. It's going to be a little bit trickier of a repo because we're going back to back. It's just us getting two vehicles and we're going to try to get both of them at once, but it's going to be pretty tricky. Uh, yeah, so the plan is we're going to roll over to the property. It's right down this road here. We're going to launch the drone up in the sky. I do have a little scouting drone. We're going to see what we can find, see if there's any ways in the garage to break in and open up the doors to get the Bugattis out. Because when we get in, the owner might, you know, go crazy. They might actually just take the car and drive away. We don't want that to happen. So uh, we should be pulling up to the property very shortly. If you guys are excited, make sure to drop a thumbs up on today's video and subscribe if you haven't already. All right, take a right here and we'll be pulling into the property. Well, actually, we don't want to pull into the property. Let's turn the lights off. We might blow cover here. Let's go ahead and pull over right here behind these trees. There we go. Turn off the truck. So there's the house. Oh, I think the door's open. We're going to go around back and see if we can find... I think, yeah, that's the garage right there. Okay, we're going to try and zoom in with our binoculars, and then we'll launch the drone. There they are. You can see the little C for the Chiron Sport. Oh, those things are nice, baby. So we've got a red one on the left side and a blue one on the right side. Description matches the repo sheet, so I'm pretty sure these are the right ones. I mean, this is the location. No license plates on the vehicle, so that probably uh, gives it away too. But, all right, as you can see, it's behind the garage door. So we're going to launch the drone here so we can find a way in. Launching drone. Here we go, boys. We are airborne. Now we're going to go check out the backside of the property. There we go. Swing the drone around. Rotate. Oh, no. We're going to hit the building. We should be high enough where the owner won't see the drone. So we're going to go around the building and see if there's any doors. Obviously, there's got the man door in the middle there. We'll probably have to break and enter that way. But we've also got two side windows on either end of the garage. So I think we'll probably break in that way. They look like glass windows. We're just going to jump through the window and then, then we'll be able to open the garage from the inside. So I think this looks good. Let's take the drone back to home. And then I think we're going to move in on this property pretty shortly. There's the tow truck. Okay, let's jump back in. And we're going to move in on this thing. I think, I don't know. I, I don't know if anyone's home. I think we should call tow dispatch and see if they give us any information. Oh, no, the backup sound. Okay, this is a dead giveaway. Let's do a circle, and then we'll probably just pull into the property. But uh, radioing in here, this is Trucker Ian. Tow truck dash 34. Yeah, what's your reporting for, tow truck driver? Uh, yeah, I'm in the process of repoing these Bugattis. Do you have any information on the property owner? Uh, no property owner information, but uh, yeah, get those Bugattis done. Oh, yeah. Thanks for the assistance there. Uh, I might need police backup. Over. Copy that. Standing by. All right. Copy that, dispatch. Here we go. We're moving in the property, boys. Lights. We don't have sirens on this one, but I think we're just going to back it up to the door. Okay. This is tight maneuvering in here. Hit their trash cans. I don't care. There we go. We just ran over their trash cans. Nice. All right. Tilt the rollback. Here we go, boys. We're going to get this set up. Okay, we got to get it positioned perfectly so that when the Bugatti gets out, we can get it on the trailer and they don't drive away. So right about there. Oh, we just hit the door. Well, that makes it easier for me. I don't have to break in now. It opened the door. Okay. All right. It should be positioned correctly. Now we're going to hook up the winch. We got to find an attached point. All I see is the tires. Can't hook onto an exhaust pipe, but I think we're going to wrap it around this rim here. There we go. Start winching. All right, boys, the car is slowly but surely winching up the trailer. As you can see, it's dragging the tires. I think the parking brake is on in the car, so that makes it a lot harder. But as soon as we get it on the trailer, it'll be fine. It's not causing too much damage. Well, I think, but this is the only way we can do it. We don't have the keys for the vehicle, so... Oh, it's getting stuck. Come on. There we go. It's swinging around. It's readjusting itself. Okay, on the trailer. Let's go. Five million dollar car. It's working. Come on. We only have like another four feet and then we can roll this thing up. All right. We're scraping the bottom. This is not good. There we go. There we go. It's almost on the trailer. Another inch or so. Okay, I'm calling it there. We're going to leave the winch attached, but now we got to tilt it. 
There we go, the blue Bugatti. I don't see any signs of anyone. They probably don't want to come out. There we go. We got it on the trailer, boys. Let's strap it down and let's move out of here. No signs of anyone. That's good. I think the property owner may not be home. I'm going to radio in to tow truck dispatch. Dad, what you radio in for? Uh, I've got the first Bugatti here, dispatch. Uh, where do I drop it off at? Uh, Chase Bank. Okay, I'm taking a shortcut. Here we go. But that was actually pretty successful. I don't think anybody's home. I think this is the time to move in. Well, I guess you got lucky. All right, sounds good. I'll uh, meet you at the bank. There we go. All right, that wasn't too bad, guys. Now we're flying light sirens. No, we don't have sirens. I wish we did. We need to get back to the house as soon as possible. We need to drop this Bugatti off because this is the time to move in and repo these Bugattis. It just saves us a headache or, you know, them taking the vehicle back. So we need to drop this off in this parking spot right there. There we go. Tilt it back. Oh my gosh, that thing is in the air like crazy. Down goes the Bugatti. So how we get it off on the trailer on this one is we actually just will release the winch and the momentum of the car actually just slides down, which is kind of crazy because this thing is pretty heavy. So it's just rolling down the trailer right now. And then once we get it to the bottom, we got to just probably leave it there. There's no really moving it. We don't have the keys. It's in park mode. But there we go. I think that's enough momentum right there. We should be able to pull forward. And all right, front wheels are on the ground. This is good. Right about there should be good. All right, let's go ahead and get this thing moved forward. Oh my gosh, look at the tow truck. But as you can see, we just pull forward and there's the Bugatti. So, all right, we're moving in on red vehicle Bugatti Chiron Sport. All right, this is the second vehicle on the list today. I found this little shortcut. Let's go back with this, but we need to get the rollback going again. There we go. Looks good. All right. I'll meet you guys back at the property. All right. There's the place, guys. So let's pray that nobody's home. There we go. Bowl in. I don't see anyone in the front yard. This will be good. Here we go. Let's hit it. Oh, no. What is this? A giant gate. Oh, he's standing right there. Look it. There's the owner. He just closed the gate on us when we were trying to gain access. Open the gate. This is a repossession. He just yelled at us and said no. Okay, well, we might have to go around the property. He installed a gate in the time that we went to the bank. That is insane. I guess he really wants to keep one of these Bugattis. All right, let's back out of his driveway. We need to rethink the situation. Let's launch the drone back up in the sky. Let's find somewhere to park this truck at for the meantime. Yeah, dispatch, you've got an issue uh, trying to repo the second vehicle. Yeah, what's your issue, Robert? Uh, yeah, the guy installed a gate in 15 minutes. It's actually a pretty heavy-duty gate. I'll just run through it. But run through it? What do you mean run through it? The bank didn't give us authorization to, to total the tow truck. I'll okay, choose that or the Bugatti. Choose. <sighs> okay, well, I don't know if I can break through the gate, but hold on. Let me walk around back. Oh, there's no gate around here, but there is a tree. We cannot get the, tr the tow truck through there, so that's going to be too tricky. And then back here, yeah, that's not going to work. All right, the only way in is through that gate. Dispatch, are you sure? I mean, the payout will pay for the tow truck. Yeah, that is true. We're getting paid $150,000 for each Bugatti, so. All right, boys, I'm going to give it the full speed here. We're going to run through the front gate. Coming in hot, boys. Air horns. Let's turn the lights on. We're coming through hot. Move it. Oh, there we go. We just broke the gate open. Move it or lose it. There we go. All right, all right, all right. I think the door. He shut the other door, so we need to find a way in. He's not engaging because you're not allowed to engage in repo activities. I'm surprised he's not mad at us, but... Here we go. I'm going to lift the door up. Oh, yeah, there we go. It was unlocked. All right, here's the Bugatti. Let's wrap a winch around it. All right, we got this thing down. Let's winch it up. Come on. Oh, no, his friends arrived. Okay, this is not good. Hopefully, his friends don't hurt us. Let's winch it. We're pushing the car up the trailer. We need to move quick. There we go. It's on. Tilt it. Let's go. All right, we need to back it into the garage. This is kind of a crazy situation. What are we stuck on? There we go. Rotate it around. We're going to back into this guy's car. Interfering with a repo service is, is illegal. You can't do this. We're backing into his car, buddy. Here we go, boys. This thing is heavy duty. Move it or lose it. Oh, we just took out his Hellcat. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no, don't lose the Bugatti. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. There we go. We still got it. Let's move it forward. Come on, come on. It's barely hanging out. I need to go down the street. They're going to chase us, but I think I destroyed their Hellcat. It shouldn't follow us, but that's insane. He called all of his friends. They were going to try and steal the car back or steal this tow truck. One of the two. But we got out of there. Let's get back to the bank. Don't lose this thing. Hopefully, there's no oncoming traffic. Ah, finally, we made it back to the city. Almost. Hold on. We're in the rear service entrance. There we go. I've got access to EXP Customs, and we'll circle back around. The bank is over there. Well, I think this has been a successful day, guys. We have successfully repoed both of the Bugatti Chiron Sports. This is probably one of the best jobs we've ever had in a long time. But, I mean, these cars are $10 million in values each. So, the bank needed these cars back. So, guys, thank you for watching today's episode. If you want to see us do more luxury repo stuff, like with Bugattis and boats and crazy stuff like this, make sure to drop a like on today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.